Hey, what up, people? Like, random here. So, in this video, I'm gonna be drawing you from Kimitsu no Yaiba. And I gotta say, I'm addicted to the anime. It's really good. I haven't read the manga because I'm too lazy to read and it kind of pisses me off because a lot of people are posting spoilers on social media. If you're one of those people, just, just stop, dude. Just, just stop. For most of you who've seen my drawing videos, I hope you notice that I always use Copic markers. But in this video, I'm not gonna be using my beloved Copics. But instead, I'll be using completely Prisma colored markers. But instead, I'll completely use Prisma colored pencils. I've had these for like months now and I do use them in my previous videos, but just for like little details. And my most abused colored pencil is the color white pencil. Here it is. Just look how small it has gotten. And compared to a Prisma color pencil that has not been used at all, because I barely use violet, but point is just look at that. The difference is major. The reason why I use the white so much is because it adds the little like highlighted details to your drawings. So yeah, if someone says a white colored pencil is useless, they are so wrong. They are so, so wrong. So without further ado, Hajime Yoka! Let's get started. Alright guys, so I'm having a bit of a problem here. Um, the Prisma colored pencils didn't blend well as much as I wanted it to and I just don't like the way the colors of the hair look. I mean, yeah, the color is there but you get this like texture where some parts are more pigmented and others aren't. I don't see, I have no idea, how do people color with Prisma colored pencils and make it so smooth, like, what's the secret? Oh well, well that's, that's, well this is disappointing. But, the video will not end badly, I will still drug you, but this time, I'll be using my beloved Copic markers again. <laughs> Without further ado, let's continue with the drawing video.
how many hours of retracing and coloring. Here is the final piece. <laughs> Finally, I, I, I love it. I like how the colors are solid. I like how they're blended. And if you've noticed, I also used the white Prisma colored pencils. Like, uh, I use a white colored pencil because to add more highlights to my drawing. So I feel like <laughs> I only bought Prisma colored pencils for. <laughs> for the purpose of using the white colored pencil, so yeah. <laughs> now, before I end this video, I gotta say, Prisma colored pencils are not bad. They are amazing. They're amazing colored pencils. I've used cheap colored pencils before. In fact, I have a set right here. Okay, that was cool. We gotta watch that in slow motion again. So this is a set of 72, I think, uh, I think, 72, I think, uh, colored pencils. It was a gift from from a friend of mine, uh, Christmas. Uh, I have used them before. I, I really like them because of the assorted colors. Uh, but, you know, I just don't use them more because they can't quite blend well with each other because they're not as pigmented as Prisma colored pencils. So again, okay, Prisma colored pencils are top-notch, amazing colored pencils. I just don't know how to utilize them, but maybe with enough time and patience, I could be able to use them in the near future. So yeah, that's all it for this video. I hope you liked it. I hope you learned something and probably go watch another Iranian video. Bye.